Let us pray. Father, in Jesus' name. Amen. Our Lord and our Father, we appreciate you for coming to this world to die for us as a sinner. That you accept our thanks, O oh Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. We thank you for this Easter period. We thank you for what you did. We thank you for your power of resurrection that you have made manifest in our life right from on Thursday, Friday. That you accept our thanks, O oh Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you because today again you made manifest in our life that power of resurrection. We will see it physically this morning, O oh Lord, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Daddy, as you go into the ministration of your word, Daddy, come and speak to us, O oh Lord, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, because we've answered. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. <coughs> we thank God, it has told the Lord has helped us uh, <coughs> this season. Um, as we all know, by the grace of God, we are celebrating another uh, resurrection season this time around. Um, and um, as we have been informed earlier that for some days now, we have been emphasizing that um, this season is a time of sober reflection. That is, um, to take time to take stop of our life and see whether uh, we do live according to his purpose or not. If not, to retrace back our step and uh, take time to... Uh, pray and seek the face of God concerning the areas of our life where we need to amend in order to be conformed to his will. And Likewise, on Friday, on Thursdays, likewise, on Friday, ni, ni, uh, on, we, Thursday, back on we reflect on a certain subject as the Spirit of God lay in my heart and uh, pray over it. And I, we thank God uh, what God did in our life, in our family, and in this assembly as a whole. I shall be a wo a kurikon ni ojo toze back on ni ojo Friday. I do kala wa lo arun fonto she ni no a ye yue ni kokon wa ni nu idile ati la arin wa la pako. Um, because of time. Ni tori a koko. We like to uh, deliberate on same subjects, but this time around, uh, in a, another dimension. Um, when I was meditating in the word of God this morning, um, as I was reading and meditating the Bible, the Spirit of God just led me again into a particular passage of Scripture which I believe is also relevant to uh, what God is emphasizing in our midst. Let us read our Bible to uh, the book of Psalms. Psalm 119. Um, and we read um, just a verse there that is to be precise, verse uh, 133. Psalm 119, verse 133. Direct my step. 
direct my steps by your word and let no iniquity have dominion over me. Verse 133. I mean, 133. Mm. Direct my steps by your word and let no iniquity have dominion over me. Amen. Amen. Um, if you are conversant with what uh, the, the Lord has been in our midst, especially for some days back, and, and to commemorate this year's resurrection, we we'll know that we will be emphasizing on a particular subject. And what is it? Sin will not have dominion over me. That is, we've been uh, examining, studying, meditating on a subject that sin should not have dominion over our lives. Ti eba ji ala ba kwen ti ati nte le a wong ro ti ati nso wala ti e yi. Lati gege bi agwe kale o shu yi. A ri pe a shi ati nou mo oro kwen ti ako yi re wipe e shi e ki yo joba lo ri mi. Which mean it is not the will of God that sin should have dominion over our life in order for us to fulfill the purpose of God our life. And for us to strive, no matter what it would cause us, no matter uh, the temptation, no matter the triad of challenges, no matter the circumstances that God might permit in our life and for sin not to have dominion of our life in order to fulfill the will of God concerning our life, we did knowledge. <laughs> It's not only prayer. Lati she a wan kan kan. O un ti o si she pata ke ju. Ti an lati she nan ne wikwe ke a she ke ne ane iman. Iman. Ane lo iman. That is not matter of prayer alone. And by his grace today the Lord will deliver every one of us in Jesus name. Amen. I said the Lord will deliver us in the name of Jesus. Moni olu wa yo den ko koma di den yoru ko jesu. The Spirit of God put something in my heart. I don't know whether it will be time for us today or probably next time. Probably we still need to go through it briefly, pray, and next time we take time to read and to study on this particular subject. Boya kan lo ninu re ni kukuru ni gege bi emi Olorun yo se gba wa laye a si le gbadura sugbon ni ojo mi a lo ninu re ni ekun rere. Amen. Amen. Um last today. Ni ano I was preparing to go somewhere. Mo pe nu lati mo pe se ara bi se le lati lo si bi kan. I was already late. O akoko ti e ti lo. But mommy was uh, joining doing sort of um environmental in the house, you no? Know? Where we have a lot of children doing some things and the misplaced some uh, many things. And mommy said, yeah, the, uh, lead, I mean, um, <clears throat> come attention to a, to a book which I bought a long time, but 
uh, I, I haven't got sufficient time to uh, go through it. I said, oh, this is one of my books that I've been keeping and uh, I haven't come to read. I said, cool. But this morning, I was led to just go through some passages briefly. And the Spirit of God led me to a particular uh, subject there, which we want to deliberate briefly this morning. Amen. Amen. Um, and it happened to be uh, the messages I've been emphasizing upon for some time now, even for years, and much more recently. And uh, I was so happy. I'm so glad. I'm so glad. But I am led by the Spirit of God. Recently, I emphasized on that topic because I am led. Please, please listen very well. You cannot grab it. Maybe you buy the uh, uh, CD uh, when it's ready. The title is Akorinoni transformed by trouble transformed by trouble that is the transformation that used to take place when you are going through trials challenges or uh, troubles of life or tribulations. No, 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 no. Amen. Amen. Because of time, maybe I just uh, <laughs> go through it quickly. For our light and momentary troubles are shifting for us an eternal glory. That far outweighs them all. Let me come up again. It's, it's a Bible passage. That is, uh, we have that in Second Corinthians chapter four, verse seventeen. Uh, oh. This is NIV translation. Oh yes, I be to one who currency KG or the Kenya say he the logo. Transformed by trouble. For our light and momentary troubles. Uh, achieving for us an eternal glory that far outweighs them all. Yes, ma'am. Nitori, if one do what's your fair, since she shall finish, you can only she shall go and nipper come to your poly called Jafua. Amen. Amen. That is a Bible, <laughs> it's a Bible quotation. Oh, yeah, or what I'm going to do that in the Bible. A man of God says, I'm not sure I'm going to it is the fire of sovereign that brings forth the gold of godliness. It is the fire of sovereign that brings forth the gold of godliness. I don't want to rush it. I decided not to rush it. Because I believe the message is very relevant to uh, what God is doing in our, in our life, in our midst this season. That, that is the time around of resurrection. Amen. Amen. Um, as I've said earlier, that knowledge is very, very important. 
The man of God says, is one of the greatest evangelists, uh, revivalists of our time. Among other things, he said, the Bible is given not to increase knowledge, but to change our lives. Amen. Amen. Am I communicating? Let me come up again. He said, The Bible is given not to increase knowledge, but to change our lives. I don't know whether it's true. Pardon? Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Let's go further. Please listen very well. God has a purpose behind every problem. He uses circumstances to develop our character. In fact, the depends more on circumstances to make us like Jesus than it depends on our reading the Bible. Amen. Our circumstances are passing through. Um, no matter the trouble, either, either, either big or small, uh, he has permitted, it's a circumstances, he has permitted uh, for character building. Is is it a lie? Oh, I can't hear you. It's true. Oh, <laughs> Amen. Amen. The reason is obvious. You face circumstances 24 hours a day. <laughs> Jesus warned us that we will have problems in the world. Isn't it? As he promised, promise, I mean, a, a problem free life. And uh, we can have that in uh, gospel according to St. John chapter 16 verse 33. If we are conversant with the Bible, you See. find it there. And uh, if we don't mind, let's go through it for confirmation. This thing I have spoken to you, that in me you may have peace. In the world you will have tribulation, but be of good cheer, I have overcome the world. I don't know whether that you can find that in, in your Bible. Is it there? God bless you. Amen. <laughs> Let's go further. No one is immune to pain or insulated from suffering. <laughs> and no one gets to skate through the through life problems free. 
o si eni na ti o le di omi ra kuro ninu ila kakatabi isoro ninu aye yi life is is a series of problems aye yi ku fun oniruru awon isoro every time you solve one another is waiting to take its place ni gbogbo ogba ti o ba ti doju ko ekan ti o ti bori re ekeji atun yoju not all of them are big ki se gbogbo re ni o tobi but all are significant in god grows process sugbon gbogbo re ni o se amuye ninu idagba soke ise olorun let me come up again eje kin tu so fun ale ekan si not all of them are big but all are significant in god grows process for you ki se gbogbo awon isoro yi ni o tobi tabi ti o lagbara sugbon o je ikan lara awon amuye ti olorun fi mu ki christian ki o dagba soke peter assures us that problems are normal peter ru je ko di mo fun wi pe isoro o je on ti a ti ya o le foworo seyin seyin wi pe don't be be the, don't be uh, be the, be the withered e ma se rewe si e ma se kaare no no don't be be withered or surprised when you go through the fiery trials of the fiery trials ahead for this is <laughs> for for there is no strange this is no strange unusual thing that is going to happen to you that is uh, let's go to first peter chapter 4 verse uh, Peter chapter 4 verse 12. Amen. Amen. I'm trying to rush up. No, I can't finish it, but we will continue later. It's some other day. I want to see what you know God uses problem to draw you closer to himself Oluwa ma lo isoro lati fa wa si odo ara re Is it not is it, is it not is it different I mean is it not different I mean is it different from what I've been emphasizing Nje o yato si ohun ti mo tin sha tenu mo laarin wa I can't hear you No ti ba ti poro se ni ke ma ja mi lese kese ma so pe eh kan ma ba doju te pass no no that is nothing like that It will help me it will help me to amend when they help me to amend say iro lo pa o o so e je o tu ya dede when you say to him ah then it make me to repent say, ah eh? so i want to write and wash me to uh-huh. praise the lord hallelujah praise the lord hallelujah praise the lord hallelujah if you see any pastor prophet or whatever he or she may call himself and telling you i mean and assuring you a problem free life say ah eh ya we o gbọn si elenu eh awon aje to wa nle yin ni oh mu ti mo no eh ya kokuro nbe eh ya kokuro nbe oko e o toju e ah eh ni sha awon aje ni ogun idile ni ah ya gbadura gbogbo bo se bo se ya oko e ni kolorun ko lu pa bo se ma nse ni yen ife se ni prophet o wa si church o den gbadura ko ye ko ni problem rara eh eh to den toju pastor na ah ah ko ye ko ni problem ah wa si church si wa abu ala ma ngba ko se ni ko so mo njo ba ko to ma ni problem pray the lord hallelujah oh na e lo so run apadi ni such pastor is sending you to hell fire if any pastor tell you that you are to live a free life full uh, not with any problem having no problem is telling you lie that is not the scripture eleyi ki se we mimo this is i mean and that pers- and uh, that uh, that uh, message is from the horse's mouth Jesus Christ himself he said in this life if you have tribulation but be of good cheer have overcome for you he said I, i'm sell, i'm sharing this with you in order to have peace that is when problem comes you should not believe that hey this father i go to church i pay my tithe offering i take their pastor whatever even i'm the one who, who build our assembly and yet where do you still have this problem Yes Oluwa fun ara re o oro yi ti enu Jesus Oluwa jade wi pe ninu aye yen yo ri ponju sugbon tuju ka nitori pe mo ti se gun aye wi pe ki nigba te ba te wa ninu alaafia awon ko nse ba nla koja ki e le ni alaafia tori pe elomi a so pe ah pelu gbogbo nkan ti mo se mi ma ni mo ko ile ijo tin ti a wa yi iki lo wa tun fa ti soro nde Praise the Lord Hallelujah Praise the Lord Hallelujah 
If I should continue, um, it will take nothing less than 45 minutes more. You uh, are 45 minutes. See. Do I continue? Yes. No. Check no. it. Why do? Some people say me. Why should she? <laughs> Some will say in another churches they spend only one hour for their own service. Recently, somebody was challenging his wife. Twelve thirty. Twelve thirty. Please go back to redeem. What kind of church is that? If you do Praise not go back to redeem where they don't waste time, I will not allow you to go to that church again. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Jesus said, yes, we pray. Ye shall know the truth. And the truth shall set you free. I want to you one hour. 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 Those people that uh, organize one hour I'm program, what I know. When, the problem, when there are problems arise, they know where to go. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. That is the essence of restoration season. To set us free from every yoke of bondage. Whatever it, whatever it is. Sink Ignorance. I obey. Ignorance is more deadly can, than cancer. <laughs> <laughs> See, cancer back, cancer ignorance. I can hear you. Oh, no, I'll pardon you. Uh, time God Straight. permits uh, cancer in the life of uh, some of his children and they will die and go to heaven. But when you when ignorance, when God allows ignorance in your life, or you yourself you allow ignorance, it will kill you and send you to hell fire. That is why some people are seeking for one for prophet, one place, I mean from one place or the other. Prophet, who will promise who will promise the heaven and earth, isn't it? As long as long as you join us, you can't have any problem. I can assure you. We pray. All your enemies, they will die. Pata, pata. Then you'll be free. Uh -huh. You'll be gay to enjoy yourself. That's right. That's right. Who is behind your problems? Pardon? It is the devil. Can you kill him? A million days fasting and prayer cannot kill him. Because it's not yet time. <laughs> and God has given me a mandate, a commission, an assignment, and He cannot do otherwise until fulfill it. Along from there, look, we share your love. That's your kind. I want to join my gala. Come on, come on, let's go. Oh, Lord, show us. Hey, I'm not going to bore you. I'm World Cup. Thing that will deliver you is oh, not so they doubt it. Any is worse, Nikki. Um, <coughs> to be totally delivered from the power of sin, waking your cure bomb in a crone, your work, but I shall cut a not to allow sin to dominate your life. Kill your mash by a shall lie, let it take a ballet or re. That is the only thing. Look at this restoration season. So when, why you don't come to the service? Or let me go to the one. I can't let you. Can we order your office? Our law, in fact, as we go out, we are going to move. We should move. 
I went to visit my friend. Trouble that she can do do as the the time I mean the opportunity God has given him. I believe all this popularly called holidays is of God. So people begin to argue that uh, Christmas uh, is not uh, is not of God and this and that. Ah, are you to are you to are you to pity this this theologians? Are you to pity? This? I believe God permitted it. It's for a season. God wants us to do what to gather together behind him, uh, to listen to His word and to be set free. It's not a matter. It's not a God is not interested in carnal celebration. Hallelujah. <laughs> 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 It's not a plea that uh, they, they, they crucified Jesus. That's where I don't know. It, it was crucified in, uh, in uh, what do you call it? In October. October, and you won't come back. It's none of God's business. Today, the Lord will meet with you. From today, your life shall not be the same again. We want to commit ourselves to the hand of God. As I told you on Thursday, likewise on Friday, the greatest thing God can do in your life is to give you the grace to live above sin. The greatest benefit you receive from God is to receive it. A transformed life. The greatest thing God can do in your life is to give you the power and the grace to live a righteous life. Then you will begin to live above circumstances. Yes, and nothing will trouble. You again. No matter what the economy they dictate, no matter the social or economy, I mean a political situation, no matter what the, the terrorists may be doing, what have what, what have you? You have peace in yourself, knowing fully that uh, God is in you and you are in him. Does the Lord? My children. I want you to pray. Who can the enemy want to attack Lagos? And I want you to pray against it. Because you have made up your mind to live above sin. I will begin to reveal secret things to you. And I will begin to share my mind with you than before. Zero of fools. Peace be unto you. Hmm. That is one of the benefits. Because a little boy like myself God told me that this time around because as I make up my mind to draw closer to him than before as I make up my mind to draw closer to him than before no, no. God told me I begin to share my mind with you than before I begin to share my mind with you than before and therefore if I just say you say bro uh, sister my 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 friend daddy mommy do this I say oh, okay, 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 okay. Ah, my, okay, my, no, <laughs> praise the Lord Hallelujah Praise the Lord Hallelujah And this is on a serious note please if for your own good, it's for your own good. It's for, your own good. It's for your own good. And before we pray that prayer for our nation, we want to call upon God first concerning our own life. Say, Lord, 
the power of your this power of resurrection. Let it follow me. In order to give me the power and the grace to live above sin. I don't want sin to have dominion to have dominion over my life anymore. I don't want sin to dominate my family anymore. Let's call upon you. Let's call upon you. Let's pray the name of you. Ora kasairi kusobra kashiri kasidaba rakuri kasiri kasidaba rakuri kasairi kasidaba rakuri kasiri kasidaba ora kapuri kasiri kasidaba ene ke puri kasiri kasidaba ha 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 Benny, 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 ora kasairi kusobra kashidaba ene ke puri kasiri kasidaba Ere ke puri kasiri ko horka puri kashida ba. Aha. Ra puri kasiri kashida ba. Ere ke puri kasiri ka horka kashida ba. Ere ke puri kasiri kashida ha ba shida ba. Aha. Oh, but when that pray very well, pray very well, pray very well. Ra puri kasiri kashida ba. Ere ke puri kasiri kashida ba. Ere ke puri kasiri kasida ba, puri ka puri kasiri kasida ba. Ere ke puri kasiri kasida ba, ra puri ka puri kasiri kasida ba. Ha 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 ha